Most homes now use a combination of circuit breakers to shut off power to electrical appliances and switches. An overloaded circuit will cause a breaker to shut off the supply of electricity to that circuit in order to prevent damage to the rest of your system. Newer homes built within the last 10 years will have GFCI sockets in addition to whole house circuit breakers. In the case of a temporary power surge due to a tripped breaker, here's what to do. If the breaker has only affected one socket, unplug the electrical cords from the outlet. Most new homes have GFCI or ground fault circuit interrupter outlets, which have their own reset button. Look for the small buttons between the two sockets on the faceplate of the outlet. If the GFCI has been tripped, instead of the main breaker, one of the reset buttons is extended. Press the button that is protruding away from the wall with your finger until it clicks flush with the outer plate. Plug your electrical cords back into the socket one at a time. Now, if the power is out to a whole wall or room, find your home electrical panel box and you will recognize it as a metal box with a door. Open the electrical panel box to reveal the circuit breakers for your home. Circuit breakers are black switches on the panel. Glance down the row of breakers and locate the tripped circuit breaker. The tripped breaker might look like it's in the same position as the others, but it will not be pushed over to the on position all the way. Flip the breaker to the off position with your finger. Wait a second and flip it back over to the on position to reset the circuit. If the circuit trips again or will not flip to the on position, you will want to determine why it will not hold the amperage. Start by turning off equipment plugged into the socket that is tripping the breaker. Reset the breaker again and slowly begin turning on the equipment one at a time. This will help you figure out which item is causing the overload. Try moving that item to a different socket. When the power goes out to a socket or an entire wall, it's usually just a temporary power surge that causes the breaker to trip. Resetting a circuit breaker is simple. Just find the breaker and turn it back on. Thanks for watching.